Hey everyone, today I'm going to show you how to use the RAN between function in Google Sheets. It's very easy to do if you're looking to create random numbers between a, a given range. I'm doing this for a video I'm making, so just want to show you how to go about doing that. If that's something you're interested in, it's got, it's got a wide range of applications, but something that can be easily applied. So here, let's say I've got you know a list of salespeople, and I'm trying to create whatever their score might be rather than go through and just kind of randomly make up numbers here which you know might require some bandwidth in your brain there i'm just going to do rand between and then just hit tab and then it's going to ask me for the low number what do i want the lowest number of my range to be so assuming this is like a you know a, a 1 to 100 percent type test let's say i want my low score to be 50 the lowest possible score that can be generated my highest possible score to be 100. So then, you know, you could go as high as a million beyond. There's really no no limit there. And you, your low, you could also do very high. Um, whatever those those two ranges, the two extremes of your ranges you want to be. So and once I have those picked out, I'm just going to hit a close parenthesis there and hit enter. So then I'm going to click. I'll, I can just click and drag that. And then it's going to give me those random numbers. So you'll see here, I've got a, a list of... You know, the scores it keeps generating. Every time I click in, it's going to give you, so before it was 70, now it's saying 50. Now it's 76, that one's 70. And it double click, it's saying 58. I'll click out of it, 83. So, so you see that one's saying 78 now. So now it's saying 58, 84. You can see it's bouncing around. Anyways, let's say we don't want that to happen. We want it just to remain as is. And so what we can do is just c control C, hit that copy there. And then we're just going to paste special and then just paste the values over it. So we can do that or we can do control shift V. So now what's going to happen, it's not going to change where you click on those cells or not. It's eliminated the formula. So we kind of have those random numbers. So again, ran between very easy, very simple to use if you're looking to generate a large list of random numbers or come up with like a generic data set or whatever it might be. It is very helpful and can help save you a lot of time. Hopefully this helps. Remember to subscribe to the Excel guy and hit the like button below. Thanks and have a great day.